So here we are this morning. Of course, it's dark out. The one and only Rod. And today, we're gonna introduce the one and only handlebar mustache, Jay Rome. And guess what he's doing here? I've gotten him up two mornings in a row. But this guy over here, he's a Model T man. This right here is a little four banger, Henry Ford. So we got this car, the chassis for this car, oh my gosh, four years ago, maybe five years ago. Built this bed, and this is where it sat, because guess what? I have no idea what I'm doing with this large lawnmower engine. <laughs> After five years of sitting, we have a switch, we have a battery, we got fuel we in the tank. Rod, we have the long handle man here, and we have gas. Most yeah, we got, we got gas. We all got gas. <laughs> and basically, they were waiting to be disappointed. All right, no, we're not. All right, should we do this? You want me to, you end up? Yeah, you push the button. Here we go. I'll get the fire thing. I think the switch is on. It's not even firing. So. Here's the switch. Here, try the switch the other way. The switch is back. Forward is off. Try it the other way. Yeah. There you go. Well, that piece of shit. let's junk it. Put it out by the curb and sell the goddamn thing. Okay, so we have high dwell, low gap. Is that what you just said? I, I think so. Well, I haven't used my dwell meter in like 20 years, so. No. So you're adjusting the points. Adjusting the points. Okay, hit the starter switch again. All right. Yeah. Here we go again. We did a little of this. We did a little of that. He's got a little squirty squirt, a little starter bang bang in there. Old long handle. Yep. No. Uh, 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 uh. I heard it. Trying. Trying. He gave a little. <laughs> We're still thinking around. You know what I think it's gonna sound like, Rod? <laughs> Which is on. We have gas. Gas. Timing's a little better. Timing's a little adjusted. Here we go. We've had some donuts. Uh-oh. We got a little jiggle train going on. I'll be diggly dogs. Damn it. We're so close. You know when you start cranking, it's old school. Holy <laughs> I can all say it's the first time I've cranked a car. Done that, cranked a car. Really? Yeah. See? Hang yeah. out. You hang out at the farm, you gotta do I just about crap my pants. <laughs> <laughs> so what's happening? What did you do? Okay. After long handle. Yeah, after, you know, too much time right. trying to figure shit out, it's like, oh, I just wonder if this coil. This coil. Is, a, is a 12 volt or a 6 volt? Because we've got a 6 volt battery in here. Well, it's a 12 volt coil. Uh, so we've so we've 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 done rigged some, up a 12 volt battery up. to just power just the coil. So that way we have the correct output to go to the. Well, yeah, a 6 okay. volt going into a 12 volt coil is not enough to make it fire the plugs. All right, so let's uh, try this. Turn the switch on. Hit the button. <laughs> <laughs> So close, Rod. So, yeah, so close. Yeah, the dwell's all wrong now since we were working with different voltage. 